Hello everyone, I am your host, welcome back to Let's Play Mega Man 6. I am your host, Melee Wizard, and let's see who we'll be facing off with next. And that would be Plant Man. Let's hope that the, I don't, want, I don't know if I should call it good karma or what, but let's just hope it continues on in this video. Bugs and frogs, or whatever the heck they're supposed to be. Ah, come on. Ooh, extra life. Must get extra life. Thank you. I really don't want to have be stuck at one life. And oh, lovely. Well, okay. That worked. <laughs> Didn't expect that to work so well. I guess there's a, there's a good thing about using the rush power all the time. Okay. And we've got... Oh! Flip top, alright. And... Eh, whatever. And here we have another one of those lovely mid-bosses. Okay, there we go. I hate enemies that close in on you like that. Especially when you have no way of making them go away except for, like, wasting shots or something. Come on, jump button. Work. I know you can work. Be more reliable. Thank you. And... Okay. I don't really I really don't want any more stupid deaths here. Because those is not good for, it's really not good for my sanity. Or what little there is of it. Oh great. I'm real I don't like how much life I've got now. Come on, give me something. Dang it. Ah. Oh! Seriously? I have to go through all that again? And I've got one life again? I don't want any more game overs. Because that just makes me look stupid. Eh. And I have to face this second mini boss again at least I dodged that one ah okay I'm in better shape now just as so long as I don't fall into any pits I think I'll be okay uh, mostly I just have to watch out for those stupid fish and Okay. Okay. I think I think I'm good now. Just as long as I pay attention. And sorry for not being very talkative right now. I guess I still have the events of Yamato man on my on the brain. But at least the rest of these bosses shouldn't be so hard. Oh well. And this guy pretty much does the same thing over and over again. He summons his plant barrier, jumps, and fires it at you. 
really not much to it. It's just that the direction that he jumps, well, you never know that until he actually does. I hope I don't need to slide for any of this. Come on, flawless victory! I know I can do it! Just two more shots. <laughs> flawless victory! I love it! Uh, and now to get probably one of the most useless weapons in the game. The plant barrier! Thing is, unlike what Plant Man just showed, you can't even fire the thing at anyone. It just stays around you until something comes into contact with it. Now, the Rust Jet, on the other hand, that is a very useful thing, and I won't be getting as much use of it as I want to because I'm stuck using Rush Power all the time. Anyway, next up on the list... Ah. And comes up as Centaur Man. Okay. Ancient city. So this is a what? Greece reference, I guess. All right. I guess it makes some sense. Hey, killing those birds in one shot. I, I'm already I'm liking rush power more and more as I do this. Of course, when the stupid birds up there, there's not much you can do about it. But. But hey, when you can reach them, <laughs> all right. Okay. Okay. All right. No falling into the spikes and no jumping into them either. Okay. <laughs> oh no! And there's a game over. I bet, isn't it? Oh, no! Okay. Oh, okay. So, having one life is not the end, it's having zero lives, that's the end. Alright. You're gonna know some different games, follow different conventions on that. And I'm just gonna ignore you. At least until you explode. Alright, there we go. Alright, now don't press the jump button so freaking hard. Ooh, that was close. Okay. Alright, okay. I feeling a little better now. I still wish I could use the Rush Jet for some of these parts, but... Well, actually they wouldn't really be helpful right now, but... Here, on the other hand... With the... Upside down water... Whatever. Die, you stupid... Frog, whatever the heck you're supposed to be. And you need to time this right... Alright. And the water disappears. All right. More of these guys. And flip top. Give me an extra life, please. Or not. Whatever. Okay. So and um yeah the stupid subs which are easier to deal with now. Thank you. But now that... Crap. Okay, alright. Got through there. And more of those things. Great. And looks like I'll be going after the fake boss on here because... Getting to the real one and the beat part requires using the rust jet. Since it doesn't affect my ability to complete the stage, uh, and 
slow downs again. Lovely. And, oh well. The boss is technically the same either way, so whatever. Yeah, this guy's pretty much got two main attacks. One, he uses the centaur flash to immobilize you, and then he has that one sh shot that that one little shot that rebounds and makes a ton of more. And yeah, and when they're used together, it can make a whole lot of pain. Hope I'm not okay. Crap. I don't want to die to him. This guy's stupid. I was so I was so close, man. And game over again. Maybe I should just scrap this whole LP, I don't know. Oh well. I can tell people are just gonna love this. I'm not even sure if I'm sarcastic about that or not. But oh well. If nothing else, it shows that I'm not a quitter. I might complain a bit, but that's mostly self-inflicted, so... But losing to Centaur Man, I don't think I've ever actually had that happen before. I mean, ever. Granted, goodness knows how many times I beat him using the Night Crush, but still. There should be no excuse for losing to him, especially when I have how many energy tanks? Like, four? I mean, I could have used energy tanks, but... Probably being the stubborn... Oh. What is wrong with me today? I don't know. It seems like half the half the time I'm Well, maybe there's something to the whole LP curse that Chugga Conroy mentions every now and again. Cuz I never really put too much stock into it and, until uh I started going through the Proto Man stages in Mega Man 5. And I thought I worked my way through that after I got through Proto Man, but I guess. Uh, but considering I've never actually done this whole rush power thing before. Well, another energy tank. Alright, whatever. Thank you, whatever. Well, I guess when you're doing things you've never done, problems are bound to prop, pop up, especially in places you would never expect them to. Time to kill you so you're not an issue anymore. Let's see if I can kill these guys in one shot. Well, no. Oh well. As long as they don't hit me. I don't even know why I'm shooting at these things. Those, as long as I'm not stupid, those things can't even hurt me. Alright. Let's try this again. With more success this time. Now that and tr maybe try to stay in the middle if he, in case he uses that centaur flash so that the shots don't actually hit me. I was trying to do that before. Goodness knows I wasn't that successful at it. And if he just trots, uh, just runs me over, then there's not much I can do to avoid it. All right. Uh. Ah. Just keep doing that. Just keep doing that, and I think I'll be okay. Just... There! Good! Alright. Uh, let's just have this level over with. And I already see that I'm over the 15 minute limit. Hopefully no one will get too upset over it. Yep, yeah. yeah. make the screen act all weird, I don't care. Alright, so until next time, this is Melee Wizard and have a nice day.